Hey everyone, welcome back to another Wine Wednesday. This time, post gym, didn't even change, still a little sweaty. But hey, I wanna drink some wine, so I'm gonna tell you about it. Uh, so I actually uh, did pair this, which you've already seen at this point, um, with some food. So this is the Flat Rock Cellars 2017 Twisted Blend. It is a white wine of a mixed variety of Riesling, um, Gewurz Demeanor, and Chardonnay. Uh, so I actually do work at Flat Rock Cellars now part-time, mostly just Saturdays, once a week-ish. Um, so I've had a few of their wines by now. I've only actually had samples of this. I don't think I've had a full bottle at this point. Don't think so. But what I like to tell people when they're trying this wine, um, it's currently our second sweetest on the list usually our sweetest, but that it's the perfect wine to have if you're going to sit and open a bottle with friends and just talk. It's very drinkable, um, easy to enjoy, most people like it, so it's very easy and it just makes you want to just enjoy and have a good time. So that's my mentality on this wine. So on the back, like always, I'll read it to you. When we created Twisted from the 2014 vintage, it was because we thought our approach to wine was a little different. We quickly found that not only was our approach a little offbeat, but our customers were also slightly warped. With Twisted, we found a wine that reflected the individuality of each one of us. This unique blend is a testament to the fact we were all happily slightly twisted. Ed. And Ed is the owner. There's two Eds. There's Ed Sr. and then his son, Ed. Doesn't get confusing at all. Um, but definitely Flat Rock is a winery you should check out if you're ever in the region. It is in uh, Jordan specifically, so not Niagara Lake, but Niagara region on your way um, towards Niagara Lake on, um, on a beautiful clear day. You can literally see the whole Toronto skyline, which is just stunning. Uh, we have great wines, uh, not too many selections. If you were someone who wants to see a list of 30 wines, you're not going to see that from us. Um, but for reds, we have uh, Pinot Noir, we have two Pinot Noirs, and we do Chardonnays, Rieslings. Um, and usually Gewürztraminer, currently we're all out, and then a few others here and there as well, but that's kind of what we mostly grow. So, yes, so <laughs> what I paired it with, um, I had paired it with just um, some Ontario food, because best thing to always do, uh, chicken, corn, and some bread, all from Ontario, Ontario chicken, corn is from Wayne Fleet, actually in the Niagara region, um, bread was from a bakery uh, here in Niagara as well. Don't really remember which one, but it was fresh bread. Still have some actually. Um, yeah, and the sauce I used for the chicken was General Taos, a little bit spicy, which plays um, with the fun of the twisted. And actually currently, well it's not over, but for the Discovery Pass for Raven Wine, we were a part of that and we actually used our twisted and paired it um, with a jalapeno cornbread with something else on it too. I don't know, but the gist of it was the jalapeno cornbread to go off the spiciness um, with the sweetness of the Twisted. So that's a little bit about the Twisted bottle. It has a nice bright yellow color to it. You can really smell the Riesling in it. It has the sweetness of it. I think it's mostly Riesling. I could be wrong about that, but I think the majority of the grapes that come out of it are, are Riesling. We get a little bit of peach. Some green apple. And a little bit of floral. This is just such a fun wine. It's so easy to drink. And again, I get that green apple in my mouth as well too. Um, it's, I would say it's like a, yeah, a semi, semi dry, kind of off dry. It is sweet, but it's not, I don't think it's crazy sweet, but maybe I prefer sweet wines. I think I do <laughs> as opposed to, to uh, super dry wines. It's really well balanced. Mm. Um, yeah, everything I said before too. Like this is a wine that you wanna sit with your friends and open a bottle with and enjoy. You will not go wrong unless somebody doesn't like white wine. Um, but people who come to the winery who don't like wine, they will do the twisted and they will get the twisted. 
and they will enjoy the twisted. And they might not enjoy anything else because they're not wine people, but they like the twisted, even though, hey, twisted's a wine. Um, I don't think I finished everything on the bottle. It is 12%, which is pretty usual. VQA, of course. And actually it's on sale right now. I don't know how long it's on sale for, but it's a dollar off in store at Flat Rock and then also at the LCBO. Uh, so $16.95 is what it is now, usually $17.95. So full dollar off. You can't go wrong with that price and what you get with this wine, it's absolutely delicious. But that is my Wine Wednesday this week. I'm gonna take another sip first. And spill, but that's okay because I still need to shower from the gym. But I'm also starving, so I don't know which one I'm gonna do next. Is eat the food or go shower. I don't know. But let me know if you've ever tried it, if you've ever had any other flat rock wines, or just what you're drinking tonight. And have a lovely Wine Wednesday, friends. Night. Totally forgot to rate the wine. I forgot that's something I'm doing now. Also, again, welcome to my messy kitchen, a series. Um, but I would say for this not being like a particular blend, like I'm not rating a Riesling, I'm rating a blend of Riesling, Chardonnay, and Gewürztraminer. I, and for price too, I would say a very solid 8.2. Very solid, super easy to drink. I haven't met anybody who doesn't like it, unless maybe you're like super wine into a certain like Chardonnay or whatever. Um, but yeah. 8.2. Sorry, I forgot. Okay, goodbye.